Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Assalamu alaikum. I hope you all are fine and staying safe and happy. I am your science teacher, Ms. Farheen, and I welcome you all to your science class. My dear students, as you know that today we are going to start chapter number 10 from your science floor books and the name of our chapter is Technology in Everyday Life. Today I am going to give you a complete introduction. So these are the student learning outcomes that will be covered in this chapter. And my dear students, a brief introduction of this chapter is that, that the technology has its roots in craft making. A renowned American scientist, Walter Lewis Alweiser, is a Nobel uh, laureate, the most pre prestigious award holder that is Nobel Prize in 1968 in physics. He invented many valuable uh, machines, equipment such as radar system, direction indicators, design landing system for aircrafts, etc. The roots of this great discoveries and inventions lie in his father's decision, that is, to subject his son to learn arts along with regular studies instead of academic studies only. Crafting strength is the ability to materialize one's imaginations. They are unlimited developing the best technologies in the world. The basic crafts of this level are paper crafts, clay molding, etc. The following chapter reflects this thought through different crafts. Are you ready to dwell in the area C of creation? So my dear students, basically, you have start kis cheez se diya gaya hai ke ek scientist hai jisko Nobel Prize mila tha. उसने बहुत सारी इन्वेंशंस की उसके फादर ने उसको रेगुलर स्टडीज का नहीं कहा बल्कि उसको कहा कि आप क्राफ्ट लर्न करें आप आर्ट्स के बारे में सीखें क्योंकि आर्ट्स जो है और क्राफ्ट जो है ये आपकी इमेजिनेशन को व्हाट यू आर इमेजिनिंग ये उसको स्ट्रेंथन करने में हेल्प करता है आप उसको पेपर पे या किसी भी क्राफ्ट के जरिए जो है वो प्रोड्यूस कर सकते हैं सो माय डियर स्टूडेंट्स इसके बाद जो है ही वाज अवार्डेड विद नोबेल प्राइस क्योंकि उसको उसकी इमेजिनेशंस जो थी वो बहुत स्ट्रांग थी और वो उनको uh, सिर्फ इमेजिनरी नहीं लेने रहने देता था बल्कि उसको करके भी दिखाता था सो माय डियर स्टूडेंट्स इस चैप्टर में आपकी एज ग्रुप के लिहाज से कुछ क्राफ्ट्स जो है वो हम आपको लर्न करवाएंगे जिसमें पेपर क्राफ्ट मोल्डिंग वगैरह शामिल है हर चीज को हम प्रैक्टिकली डेमोस्ट्रेट करेंगे जिसको आप लोग बहुत एंजॉय करेंगे सो माय डियर स्टूडेंट्स लेट्स गेट स्टार्टेड विद लेक्चर नंबर 1 इन व्हिच द स्टूडेंट्स विल बी एबल टू प्रैक्टिस टेक्निक्स ऑफ फोल्डिंग कटिंग टियरिंग एंड पेस्टिंग पेपर्स कार्डबोर्ड टू मेक ऑब्जेक्ट्स एंड पैटर्न्स then in lecture number two, the students will be able to design paper bags, envelopes, cards, face masks, etc. So my dear students, once you will learn different techniques with papers, folding, tearing and etc. Then you will be able to design a lot of other things. Then in lecture number three, the students will be able to make envelopes. Then in lecture number 3b, the students will be able to design face masks. Then in lecture number four, the students will be able to design models of spheres, cubes, prism, cylinders and cone with the clay or play-doh then in lecture number five the students will design models again with the clay then in lecture number six the students will design hammer wheel rollers and gears using clay or play-doh so my dear students lecture number six mein bache jo hai play-doh ko use karte hai, hammer jo hai wo banayenge then in lecture number seven the students will uh, design wheels gears and rollers with the help of play-doh then in lecture number 8, the students will operate tablets, mobile phones for use of calculator, alarm clock and calendar. Then in lecture number 9, the students will be able to operate mobile phones for taking snapshots. Then in lecture number 10, the students will be able to recognize the uh, for items of first aid box. In lecture number 11, the students will be able to use digital and clinical thermometer externally to measure body temperature so my dear students lecture number 11 may bachcho ko thermometer ki help se body temperature or external temperature jo hai wo measure karwaya jayega then in lecture number 12 the students will check blood pressure pressure by digital blood pressure monitor then the lecture number 13 uh, 13 will be the review of this chapter in which you will uh, revise all the student learning outcomes and reading pages by the end i will provide you with an assessment sheet to evaluate you so my dear students, you will learn a lot of things and you will enjoy this chapter. So stay tuned for all the activities. Have a good day. Thank you so much and Allah Hafiz.